What is your phone's net worth? Can you get $100 from 100 people that's in your contacts? That's $10,000. Can you get $50 from each of the 100 people in your contacts? That's $5,000. If you can't get it, you should start erasing your contacts. What is your phone's net worth? Now, I'm not saying that we should know people just to get monies from them. But what I'm saying is contact. People are available to access you. You made yourself accessible. And if you can't contact them to benefit, if you've got 100 contacts in your phone and you can't squeeze $10,000 out of your phone and you can't squeeze $5,000 out of your phone, then who's contacting you and who are you in touch with? So I asked the question, what is your phone's net worth? You should really be able to get $1,000 from 100 people in your contacts. And that'd be $100,000. But we're not going to do that. What this is, is a testament to who you have surrounded yourself with. We got to remember that the people that we call friends exist at different levels. There's a, hier there's a hierarchy. There's a tier system when it comes to who we call friends. And I'm explaining to you guys what I mean by that. There's a tier system. On the bottom level, where we reside in poverty, we establish who our friends are as people who are always there for us but there for us in terms of what type of times people that are there for us when it comes to fighting i might need to bust somebody's ass or i might need to get somebody jumped or someone just jumped me i got some friends that no matter what i'm going through i can make a call and they'll be down to fight we call those good friends because they always got our back then we got other friends that you know what let's say i'm struggling you know, with a breakup, I'm going through a relationship issue. I can vent my frustrations to my friend. I can cry on him. Let's say someone dies. I can cry on the shoulder of my friends. So friends and family tend to be there for us when people die. They tend to be there for us when there's gossip or when we need to vent our frustrations or we're emotional, we're sad because of a breakup. Someone has betrayed us. They're there for us when we need to fight somebody. But when it's time to purchase some real estate, I can't get my gang banging friends to help me in the acquisition of that real estate. Who are they gonna beat up so the contract can be signed officially? Who are the friends that I go to often to cry on their shoulders to let them know how I feel about a woman who has hurt me or you let them know how it feels about a man that has hurt you? How will that empower you when it comes to erecting a private equity group? So at the bottom level, we pick our friends based on anxieties and depression. And what we'll find is the people that we are, are, who we make closest to us in our life, they're not resourceful when it comes to manifesting our dreams, when it comes to manifesting our goals, when it comes to having the education or the knowledge thereof, the resources available to be able to facilitate the goals that we have. That's when our friends are, it's just understood that they don't have to be there for that. You be picking people in your life that don't have to be there for you when it comes to doing real adult things and becoming an entrepreneur. So I say, look into that phone again. Look into your phone and look at all those contacts in your phone. And when you look at all those contacts in your phone, ask yourself, are these people in these contacts mostly relying on me? Or can I rely on them? Is it mutually beneficial? I believe everybody should use each other. But we can't have this one-way thing. So if you're wondering why you're struggling, if you're wondering why you're failing, you got to look at the people you surround yourself with. If you look through your contacts and you honestly say, damn, I can't even rely on almost everybody in this contact list. If you realize in your phone you got a bunch of contacts and if you had to do something important, I'm not talking about fighting. I'm not talking about crying on someone's shoulder. People pride themselves in saying, oh yeah, I got friends. Yeah, because when I was going through this, I was able to tell them and they helped me out. You know, that's people use God for that. Just use God for that. Say that God helped you go through your trying times. And then boom, X everybody else out. Just use God for all those things. Because at the end of the day, if you got 100 contacts in your phone, 50 contacts in your phone, and you can't generate 10,000 like this inside of 24, 48 hours, it's time to erase those contacts, people. It's time to erase them. This is some real talk. And, you know, 
I know it hurts people's feelings, but this is why you could only afford to have one or two people that can't afford to help you out in your contact list. So make that your mommy and your daddy. And hopefully your daddy left you or your mama left you so you don't have to have both of them occupy that space. You could only afford, and in many instances, you may you may need to cut them off too. I, I didn't come here to with the heal the world message. I came to separate mother and father. If they're not available to you, you are no good to no one if you're no good to yourself. And a lot of times you take two steps forward, you have to take 10 steps back because someone's being evicted, somebody needs to borrow money. They, they know that you're the one that got the head on your shoulders. They watch you study. And now that you start making your money, they want to see if it works. And then if it works, then they want to copy off your test paper. You the one that put in the risk. You the one that put in the time. And everybody's just like, let's see if it works with you. And if it does, then we enable them by helping them out. Help people help themselves and make them figure it out themselves, people. I know this message hurts, but I just got through a conversation with some people and I, I needed them to build. See, when people ask me, how, how do I get where I'm at? You know, I just let them know simply, I got here. I got here because I grind. I work real hard, man. I'm too smart to be broke and it costs way too much to be poor. I got here because I work hard, bro. That's what I do. We not gonna play no games. Like, um, how you doing that, man? Hey, what's up, King? Huge fan, bro. Hey, thanks, King. Yes, sir. Peace to you, God. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're not gonna play games like we don't understand what's going on. We're not gonna do that. You know? It's a blessed, blessed thing. Blessed thing. Let me show you guys. Man, it's good to be a teacher, man, because I ain't supposed to be parked here. It's police parking, right? And the brother that came through. It's parking enforcement. But you know, he said he listened to the he listens to the knowledge. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about here, man. Talk to me nice. I'm in the Batmobile, you heard? It's good to be brother polite, man. It's good to be brother polite. Man, talk to me nice. You know we don't you know we don't close our own doors. You know, we don't close our own doors over here. But yeah, so when you look in your contact list, right? Look at this. Let me show y'all something. I got the end of money text. Go to brotherpolite.com. You need the classes to understand the text. Don't be like the people who be lost in the sauce. Like, yo, I don't know what to do after I get the text. You need the classes. Get you BP contract killers. Get gold in the crisis. Get the day trading course. Because right now, I'm doing the next session of the day trading course this Sunday. So what I do, I always show and prove. Before I do a class, I like to show people it's light work. So I sent out a text today, an in the money text, because I'm doing a class on how I knew to make the money today. So I just want you to see, because I always show and prove. So look at this. I sent out this text today. And we're also day trading contracts. So I'm mixing up the BP contract killers class with the day trading class. And I got people trading contracts. So if you look at today's return and total return, and you see it says four contracts, you see this person right here, Brother Polite, in the money text, made $892. Look at that. Today's return, $892. Look at that. Look at that. Let's go to the next one. This person made over $3,000. You know we always keep the people's names here so you can look them up. Okay? I sent out this text today for AMC for us to day trade. But I'm building a class around it. Okay, so he made over $3,000. This is on my Instagram story. So you go on the Instagram story. Anything that might not be clear, you can go right on the story. You can look it up. He made over $3,000. Got the end of money text about AMC. Had to use the three C's and applied it along with the knowledge I derived from the options class. Here's the result so far. Salute to you. So I said, I love to show and prove before conducting class. I will see you this Sunday for our next day trading class, 7 p.m. Eastern time, brotherpolite.com. So you go to brotherpolite.com, get your day trading course. But look at this. When I send a text, it's money. When you guys begin text from these other people, you, it probably costs you money. Look at this. He made $145 today in 30 minutes. I will see you in class Sunday. Okay? And a lot of you should have known about RCL from last week and the week before because I sent those messages out. But again, if you're in class, you know how to use these texts properly because now I'm using the lingo because the day trading thing is going to be a lot more intricate in detail. And what we're about to do with the contract killers course for this Sunday is going to be a lot intricate in detail. So I expect you guys to know the words and the terms because I can't be giving definitions to the verbiage in the text. That defeats the whole purpose of making sure you can make a move in real time. He made $1,670 in two hours. 
Look at this. What I'm doing. I'm doing. At 100 and lucky. Started listening a year ago just to make today a good day. That's what I'm talking about. Look at this. He made over $6,000 today. I will see you in class Sunday. I'm up on RCL calls. Peace King, thank you for all the things you are doing for our community. Okay? Check it out on my story. Everything will be nice and clear for you. If it ain't clear enough, check it out on my story. Instagram story. He made over $6,000 today. Look at that. Just take a look at that. That's wild. Hold on. We not done. King Neck. Net Buccaneer, he made $550 in 30 minutes. The market has only been open for 30 minutes. $550, people. Two contracts. Come on. We're not done. And I want to make it clear at 100 and Lucky, I teach you how to make money even if the stock goes down. So people be saying, yo, it's risky because if the stock goes down, you could lose money. You know, if the stock goes down, we make money on the stock going up and we make money on the same stock going down. So this person had bought a $26 put when he made his bread. So talk to me nice. I'm taking my profit and coming to the three-day summit. Thank you. I got a $500 three-day summit that I'm doing. You see me live in person and we're going to trade in person. We're going to trade live. So you're going to make money. You're going to pay 500 to get in there. It's for three days. But when the market open, I'm going to trade right in front of you guys. And you guys are going to trade right with me. So that one's 500. I'm doing it two months from now. So the dates and the venue is to be announced. So you ain't got to worry. But the price will go up as we when we find the venue and we establish the date, the price will go up. So those people that just know they're going to show up and pull up to that, that'd be the day I tell everybody quick they goddamn job. Because, you know, stack your bread and see me that day. I'm the only one bold enough to say, come with me. I'm going to have a big PowerPoint projected there. Internet service. I'm going to trade live for everyone to see what I do in real time. Because I got the fucking sauce, man. This is what I do. This is what I do. I told you I'm the stimulus check. Well, that's what my students called me and I went with it. I came here to make my people money. Real talk. Make money every day. Not week to week. Not bi-weekly. Not month to month. Look at this. It's a $99 damn class. Next class is this Sunday, 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Day trading course. Get to that course. This is all on my Instagram story, people. Stock market course. Master the stock market through the contract killing course. Contract killers. Say I make money off these contracts. Hold on now. Look at this person. $624. $632. $898. This person, my day traders and contract killers eating. He made over $2,100 today. In four hours, he made... $2,100. Come on, man. Now, look, get money in minutes. I'm better than Western Union. You know, anybody ever use Western Union? You know, you had to send money in minutes, right? Well, he made over $200. Brother Polite, 120 in 10 minutes, 105 in an hour. Look at that. Look at that. Money in minutes, man. Hey, right, peace, man. gang. Take it easy, man. <laughs> He's my brother, man. Do your thing. Yeah, so he made, let's, let's look at this. He made. $120 in 10 minutes and $105 in an hour. Okay. Thank you for the stats, King. Look at that. Them texts I sent out today. Because I do this to show you that it can't be done. So I don't like to do a class. Whenever I do the next session, I like y'all to use the information in between sessions instead of asking, what's the next class? What's the next class? This is not school where you go class after class after class and you don't use the information that you've been going to class for for years. I take a break, use the information from class, use your in the money text, that's what those tools are for. Whatever you don't understand, when we get back to class, you'll find that information. When you guys be sending me questions, I be incorporating the answers in class. That's how I'm able to gauge what everybody needs. That's why I don't be stopping the courses until a very long time thereafter, because I want to exhaust all the answers that are necessary. Okay, so we have the day trading course, the next session coming this Sunday. I expect to see everybody there. Quit those goddamn jobs. What is your phone's net worth? Who's sending you texts and are you benefiting? Look at this. Blessings and abundance to the sister right here. She said, Master Teacher, thank you. Moving crypto monies to pay for car repairs and people just staring. Thank you forever. So, you know, she's in my Forex trading cryptocurrency course. She's making her money. You know, brotherpolite.com. That's where you go, brotherpolite.com, and that's where you buy your classes. Any other site is fake. Just go to brotherpolite.com. Don't fall for it. Brotherpolite.com. I just pinned the comment, all right? 
and I gotta fly out, people. I got my daughter's birthday's coming up. She's about to turn two. But you know, we gotta put this work in. Look at this. He made over fourteen thousand dollars. Hotep King, keep doing what you're doing for the people. Abundance and blessings to you and your family. Contract killer. Look at this. Over fourteen thousand dollars was made. Eight contracts. Well, you know, let's see what he made in the Dizay. Come on, man. Talk to me nice. No one's doing it like I do. Stop telling me, oh, you know, I know somebody is doing what you. Then tell them, post the receipts. Post the receipts. When I get ready to do a class, yo, let me let me show you what I can do. I sent this text out this morning just to show you. Now I'm going to build a whole lesson around how to make this 14000 damn dollars. How to make that $6,000 in a, in a couple hours. How to make 500 in 30 minutes. That's what I'm about to do. Come on, man. Talk to me nice, man. Or don't talk to me at all. This is what I really do, man. It be making me want to curse sometimes. I be this damn good. I be wanting to curse. I be wanting to curse sometimes. Because it don't make no sense. Because I got people that have been doubting for years. And I keep saying, send your doubt elsewhere. Don't ask me about stuff based on your doubts. I ain't got time for that. We got peop real people here studying and making it happen. You taking up space in my inboxes and in my DMs and in my emails. It's too many messages coming through. If you're not serious, move on. And don't forget the cash is king, credit is queen course, because I'm helping people get that $100,000 in credit. Cash is king, credit is queen, credit restoration course, helping people get that 100 bands. Why? So when they get access to that money, they can stop playing these games. So that 14000 is 140. So that 500 is 5,000 and that 5,000 is 50. I make sure you get access to the money and then I'll show you how to convert the credit into cash. Yes, we do have Cash is King, Credit is Queen installment coming back up again. That class is coming back up again. See you this weekend. We're not playing no games. I'll see you all this weekend. The courses is making people bread. But me personally, I just got a thing where I like to show and prove. So I, I got up today, I said, before I fly out, watch this. My wife like, yo, this, this don't even make no sense. She bragging to her friend and everything. She's like, yo, <laughs> polite just be sitting here. Like he decides when he's gonna turn the button off and on. Sends out the end of money to her. I said, watch this, watch this. I'm seeing the receipts inside of 30 minutes of market, people sending me receipts. And I got more, I gotta post them. I just had to get this going and make this happen because I gotta get ready for, to fly out. But I just wanted to show you guys, man, is light. This is light. And if people were losing money off my text, you would know. The only issue is people expect me to send out a text every day. And I say, I don't do that. That's disingenuous. I sit down, apply myself. Boo, 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 boo. I do the knowledge. I send it to you. Let's go. Let's cook. Every time I got this day trading course, when we started the first session, I did this just to show you. And I did it again. And the reason why I do this is to motivate you and give you the conviction that, yo, you're dealing with somebody that knows what they're doing. Because ain't nobody else saying, oh, I'm going to teach you how to make money every single day of the week. So what I'm going to do before I teach you how to make money every single day of the week or during the day, money in minutes, like Western Union, money gram shit. Before we do this, let me send you something. Let me send you something so you can take a look at it. And I send you something, you take a look at it, you go, woo. Yeah, he damn sure. And those, and all of you that's in, my, in the money text, you can say, honestly, he did send that out this morning. Shit. Whether you missed it. Or you made it. You can sit there because I don't post every receipt of every single body that's walking with me. These are the people that choose to send me their receipts. Thank you. Don't be reluctant to send it. Because I like to send it to show people and prove, yo, this is what it is. And show and prove is not for the detractors. Show and prove is to the people that are working hard, that realize you're not put on this planet to be working on 9 to 5. You wasn't born on this planet to be building other people's dreams for so long. There's nothing wrong with working. But I, I say we should all be retired around 27, 30 years old. That's if that's then that's late. That's old. Cause we should be making money from the time we 13 and learning about it. My daughter already know how to day trade. My daughter be be playing with the paper trading so long that I start giving her her own right to start making real money. We shouldn't play games. Be no cash. I see you. Send me something. Send me a receipt. Be you know so they can see that I just posted a receipt. I know you always working. Be no cash. You he one of my top students. That that man be always working. Changing lives over here, man. I'm the stimulus package. You ain't gotta get caught up in no PPP payment protection program fraud shit. You ain't you ain't gotta claim no money that they don't wanna really give you and they giving most of that money out to the banks to bail them out and then the small black businesses, they don't give them no money. And then when and then when black people do get a PPP loan, they finding them to commit fraud. But the banks are committing fraud because they ain't need no fucking money in the first place. 
whoever's, whoever's distributing the loans is committing fraud because most people that's black is not getting the loans in the first place unless they do it the wrong fucking way. How come we get all these reports of all these black people getting the money from doing it the wrong way, but all these innocent black people that's been, a, that's been applying, they get in trouble for reapplying and they get in little to nothing if they get anything. So how, how many black people can only, it seemed like you got a higher probability of getting the money if you do it in a fraudulent way than if you sit there, be humble, and you fill out the application to let them know I'm a struggling business. You guys kept making me close my, my business down every time this pandemic happened. Then you gave me the limited seat and thing. Then you made me close it down again. Then you gave me the limited seat and thing. Then you close it down again. I couldn't survive two, three laps of that shit. But the small black businesses couldn't get it. But a lot of European businesses and Asian businesses got it. But the mom and pop shots got shitted on. So now it's even more vacant stores in the community. And then what that's doing is devaluing the community so other people could come in because their community is going to be cheaper. Our community is going to be cheaper so they could come in and gentrify because their community is more expensive. I was just devalued from the riots that took place in the interim of the pandemic. And it's devalued because these businesses had to shut down because they couldn't afford to close and open and close and open and close and open again. So now that the damage is done, now there's a vaccine and now everything's opening up, but these people can't open up their businesses again. So you need a fucking Messiah when it comes to money, but you can't, you can't get that because everybody's telling you for the love of money is evil and you can't die and bring that with you. So everybody's against all this shit. So you could go through the eye of a needle. An elephant is more likely to go through the eye of a needle than a wealthy man get into the kingdom of God. And of course y'all inherit the world and all this other fucking goofy shit that people constantly got in their minds. So you're afraid to make money and you're content with a subpar lifestyle. We come from the blood descendancy of royalty. Start behaving like it and stop accepting less. I gotta get ready to catch this flight, man. I hope to see all you guys in class. Brother Polite 45 uh, at gmail.com. That's my email. I'm tripping. Go to brotherpolite.com and get your cash as king, credit as queen. Get access to your 100K. This is your right. Okay, get your BP contract, killers course, make money off of contracts, thousands of dollars at a time. Get the day trading course, make your money every single day of the week, not every week. Don't work hard and get paid every two weeks. Don't work hard and get paid every month. Some of you got seasonal jobs and then you laid off by the next season. It's time to level up. It's time to take this to the next level. I really do this. And I got more receipts coming. I do this for real. Jerk. Peace. Yes. Hey, who are you? I was doing a live stream. I'm about to pull up and, and, and pack up. My stuff is already packed. I'm about to fly out right now. I'm just down the block. I'm about to, I'm about to pull up. Okay. All right, peace. Yeah, I see y'all later. That's my call, so I don't miss my flight. I love you guys. Do this for yourself, man. Free up. You ain't supposed to be working to no 60-something years old in your lifetime. You're supposed to be working 67 years old. You work to 67, 68. They'll give you more benefits, right? But the, but the, the catch-22 is your lifetime expectancy is 72 years old. And the men die sooner than the women. So you're on the way out by the time you finally retire there ain't no lifestyle for us man we supposed to be retiring about 27 30 years old we supposed to been had this information let's not be crazy hey it's brother polite man i'm too smart to be broke y'all know that look at this sexy thing i just got Woo! this red bottom bag is mean I'm giving y'all a sneak preview of, of how the trip gonna look for this weekend. Sheesh, my bag is a bag. Y'all talking about getting to the bag? Man, by the time y'all get to the bag, that bag costs the price of this bag. My bag got a bag. This ain't a game. My goodness. You know, I be into stuff like this, man. This is me. I, Cause I, I, you know, I got stuff I gotta do. I got stuff I really gotta do. You know, and I'll tell you, like, it's all money. Like, I, I just be needing, it's all money. You feel me? It's all money. What's that, 20 Gs? It's all money. Like, come on, let's not play games. Hold on. Hold on. That's not it. It's all money. Like, I got to travel. My bag is packed. Hold on, we, we, need, we need to go further? Come on, we need we need to go further. Hold on. You got a Ziploc. You want ones, twenties, fives? Ziploc bag here. It's all money. You know what I'm saying? Word up. But never mind that. The goddamn bag is bread. 
I'm not even gonna play. I'm not gonna hold you. Today's a light day. No, it's a light day. When I mean by it's a light day, you know, I I, don't, I only got 60 plus grand on me today because I gotta travel out. I don't want them treating me like fucking terrorists or some shit for having six figures on me. You really think I'm gonna sit here and sing the chorus to ya? Landing on it doesn't want to work to be able to afford throwing that ass in the circle. This is lyrical fitness. Sick and I'm gifted. It's ridiculous. This prick is a feminine bitch with two bars and a cane into the center of his lip. Twizzlers get bit. The color of lipstick to smother his kids with. Looking like a booty goon pirate. Screaming out. Take a douche kit. Shove it up and swipe them like a pool stick. Slam them in the lock. Up and doing live streams in the night. In pajamas. A buttoned up shirt with the boxes. Get the glocks on. Let it off. Uh. Catherine Brown look like one of them cake. Faces in a magazine, mad at me. I would happily take her on a date, Applebee's. Jack off my sperm in a plate, bone appetite. I'm a good guy, Chucky in the flesh. Old school rap, you're not rocking with the best. Mind ding a ling, mind ding a ling. I want you to play with mind ding a ling. Scarlet, oh, oh shit, I'm getting off time. Picking up a long time, just coming all that once. You a tourist, surgeon can lure his girl to adore us. Oh, mama, ocean. Babylonian, Machiavelli is by me, Norman. Solomon's a king, on a monopoly. You're not the lottery, you're my your property, monopoly. Oligopoly, commodity is what you got to be. Socrates, philosophy. Bomb atomically, Montavious, wood grain, wants wobbly, falling me. What up, girl? I'm King Kong conscious. Shake your little booty till my dick get longer. I'm the type to rearrange your face in the mirror. Your circadian rhythm is as blurred as your vision. Showing this pig with a dope and pinch of the go and get rid of the dough. I'm a flip, son. Of a bitch, can't you all take a joke? Who want the smoke when I put out the flame? I do this forever, ain't new to the game. In conclusion, however, the screws in my cranium calculated every move when I'm making them low and shit again. On a track, when I mess up, I'm like, oh, what the fuck? Just get to the facts. Sweating like, yeah. Here, kitty, kitty, there's 20 kittens literally here. Sitting with me staring at pennies Hoppity hop, skippity skip The hook, this is an it This is the bridge and it goes as hard as Tiffany's tits The kid is a menace Before the doors are closed Will those see though the rodeo Forgot the lyrics to the song and 